I'll make you submit. Father. But first, a word from our sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. Forget everything you think you know about mobile games. Raid Shadow Legends is a... The entire crisis began when V visited Devil May Cry and hired Dante to take on the Demon King Yuri's and Now, V has left Nero's side and discovered Sparta is near his wielder, Dante, who appears to have been comatose since his battle with Yuri's and With hatred and vengeance in his eyes, V brought the sword down toward Dante. But as the blade descended, Dante's eyes flicked open. Come here. The hell? Wait, what? You need to hide, Dante. No matter what happens, you must. Find oh, him. oh, it's mother. <laughs> find Virgil. I promise I'll be back. I know this is hard. You must listen to me. Be a big boy, a man, huh? But mother. <laughs> if I don't return, you must run by yourself, alone. You must change your name. Forget your past and start a new life. As someone else. A new beginning. Virgil, where are you? Where so is that why he changed his name to Tony Redgrave when he met Morrison? Like it said in that one letter? Look at you with all that facial hair. I know how stubborn you can be. I thought it might be the only way to wake you. What day is it? The 15th of June. Uh, a month? <clears throat> no wonder I'm so stiff. Right, sunshine. Now put a fire under it. We gotta get going because that annoying pimple Nero is making a beeline for Uris and if he gets there, he's gonna... Oh! <laughs> nice. This is my gig. Leave Nero out of this. If you could defeat yours, in, then I never would have dreamed of using that child. But yours, in, is much stronger than we ever could have imagined. Okay, please, please tell me. Oh, what? Oh, flashback again? Oh, to when we first got here? Oh, look at that! Yes, we do get to see the other colors! Oh, it stinks in here. I know. It smells like hot garbage. This is far worse than I thought. There's no crime in turning tail, V. These things might be a little too much for you. You're right. I'll leave the rest to you. What? 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 Whoa, whoa, whoa. My, my, V. All the way down here and turning tail, really? Huh? One must always have an insurance policy. <laughs> Who was that guy? I can't believe he just ran. No one special. Come on. Let's go clean up this garbage. First come, first serve on the targets, right? Music to my ears. Hurry up, Dante! Guess I get to see it with my own eyes. If it really is you. Hell yes! Not only do we get to play as Dante, but we get to see all the rest of the colors at the very end. Stylish combat, damn right. And uh, even though this is the first mission with Dante, we're gonna go with the EX colors. Uh, for the rest of the game, though, we will be using the uh, original colors. After this, I'm gonna switch the. Okay, okay, I'm really, really happy right now because I'm looking at the side and I'm seeing what they got there. And uh, you can buy purple orbs with him too, which means we start with a devil trigger. 
Oh, but we can't buy things. No. Damn it. Oh, well. We got 36,000. By next mission, we'll have plenty to buy stuff with. All right. So we got sword and uh, whatever that other thing is. And then we got pistols and shotgun. Because, you know, whatever would I do without my shotgun? So, yeah. Um, we got a weird full circle going on because it's like Nero's grandmother made ebony and ivory and then Nico's father was Agnes from DMC4 I don't think they ever explicitly state it here and then what the hell is that quickly change your weapon oh nice what is this Did that guy really do this well, no for taste is this Ifrit? Hold on, let me... Can I check? Is there any way to check? Did not realize that side would come with the controller, too. Ah, yes, the legendary Devil Hunter. I need more power! <laughs> okay, that's enough. Go to Swordmaster. Let's just start with Rebellion. And let's uh, let's do this. I'm assuming this is Ifrit, but I have no clue. I don't think there's any way I can look and see. And of course we got... Okay, so pistols do have the same vibration that they did before. But because they're level 1 pistols... Okay, so here's Subhuman. We're going to have to change this uh, eventually. Chase Styles, I know. Trickster, Gunslinger. Yeah, I know how all this works. Oh, oh, it's so good. Oh, it's so good. I love it already. Hell yes. Okay, there's a bit of a delay when you switch weapons, so you're not immediately firing when you do that. But we got this thing, too. So, for the rest of the game, uh, another thing I want to point out. I played Public Enemy for V's theme, just because I thought it would fit. Oh, a million stab again! Yeah! Oh, it feels so good to get all these moves back. Oh, I felt the same way when I switched to women 4. And Lady and Trish are just watching. Oh, this feels so nice. I'm just missing my stinger, but I have to buy that, so... That somehow makes less sense than losing your equipment with each game. Like in Metroid. Because, like, this is just him, like, learning his stinger move? And then just forgetting it by the ne by next time. And we got Devil Trigger, which is uh, it's not maxed out, but it's pretty close because we still have to find the rest of those uh, those shards or fragments. Wow, lady! Wow, don't help or anything. Just get on the other side of the gate. Okay. So, Devil Trigger in this game looks pretty sweet, not gonna lie. We get powered up bullets too? That's awesome. Usually you don't get that. Oh, we get the million stab. Oh, it feels so good. It's weird because we've been playing as Nero the whole time, but... Because, like, how much have we had now? Like, I didn't realize we'd get missions where you pick characters, too. But Dante will, like, whatever. If there's a character switch thing later on with Dante, then I will absolutely pick Dante and no one else. Because are you kidding me? This guy's great. Ah, oh, yes, the classic. And I still don't understand how it works. Because I've seen people continuously do this, but I can never figure it out. I don't know if you hold it. Yeah, I don't know. I don't get it. 
Oh, wait a minute. What, do, what, I can't do that anymore? I can't do the spinny gun trick thing? That Joker totally stole in Smash Brothers? <laughs> Seriously, like when you use his neutral beat in the air and you start aiming it downwards and he spins and starts shooting the gun like crazy, they totally stole that from Dante. I've been wanting to say that for a while now. Once I, once I started playing these games, that's one of the first things I noticed as soon as I switched over to Gunslinger. It's just like, hey, that looks familiar that I played Smash Brothers again. And it's like, oh. Oh, okay. Further proving the point that Joker has next to no original moves. <laughs> uh, I still love playing as him, though. Nah, come on, I screwed this. God, I, I'm screwing this up because I don't have older moves. It's weird. So I don't know if this is Ifrit or if this is the thing. I don't think it's the thing he had in 4 because it looks a little bit different. And in 4, wasn't it like through the box that he got it? And I like how it switches instantly with like what you're wielding instead of just like... You switch the weapon, and then you, once you start attacking, it switches over. So that's nice. It's a very minor thing, and it still looks awkward as hell, but... It's better this time. Okay, I can buy things now. I can buy things, and that makes me happy. Speed, air hike. Rebellion gets Stinger. And then it gets... Stinger 2 and the... Million step. But I already have a million stab. Oh, this is the one after the stinger. Okay, it's a separate move. Okay. Balrog, that's what it's called. The hell is Balrog? Which one was that? I don't remember. <laughs> um. <sighs> charge shot. Eh. Maybe. Charge shell. Same kind of thing there. There's separate upgrades for your styles? I forgot about that. I forgot there was a, was that, that was a thing in four though, right? Wasn't it? I'll have to get those at some point. What's the equipment for him? Do I have extra things I can, I don't think I have extra things I can buy right now. Just cause like, well, I, uh, weapons I mean, not like, in general I can buy all these things. Um, kinda wanna get Stinger too, but I don't know, speed. Uh, maybe... Yes, absolutely trigger heart. Yes. I need that. Okay, and the rest... Most of these are pretty standard. It's like what they are with the other characters. I don't know if I want... I don't want charge shot, but... I'd rather just have, like... Yeah, it's just an upgrade to charge shot. I'd rather just they shoot po faster or are more powerful. Like, I don't want DMC2 powered pistols. I want DMC3 powered pistols where it's like, it's just enough where you can deal with some small enemies, but not enough to the point where it renders the re other weapons null and void. What is Shredder? I don't know, but I'm going to use Swordmaster the most, so I'll get this one. Round trip. Round trip. I know what that is. That's interesting. So they removed those moves from the upgrade list and now you have to buy them as style upgrades. That's interesting. And we'll get something for Balrog too. Okay, that's weird. I don't know. I'll have to get used to that first. I think I'll buy Stinger too once I'm running out of upgrades. Actually, you know what? I take that back. We're going to customize again. I want to go back in there. I'll buy Million Stab for the Stinger and then I'll leave. Unless I don't have enough points for it. Or enough orbs, I mean. No, I do. I can't get both, though. That kind of sucks. I'm really close to having both. All right. Took a little bit longer in customization than I thought I would. Sorry. But let's uh, let's get on with it. The hell? Is he stuck? What the hell? <laughs> you idiot. You better watch out, it's a... 
Chaos. Really? Okay, I guess. So you have to like stick it basically. Ah, uh, the classic. More classic than what I was doing with Nero because now I have the pistols. Alright, what else do we got? I like that. Just. Yeah, he has to basically get him stuck. Why is my million stab not working? Am I not doing it right? Ooh, Trickster's real nice. Ooh, that was cool. Sorry. <laughs> I was just I was just looking at the top part of the screen and like it looked like it was shifting a little bit. Ugh, can break those things. Things gonna close if I don't hurry. Oh man, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait. Yes! I've been wanting to do that all game! And now I can't do it again. Alright, whatever. I was wanting to do that the instant kill all game. Because I found out about that in DMC1. And I was just like, hell yes, this makes this enemy so much easier to kill. And I couldn't do it with Nero because I had a pistol. Uh, but now that I have a shotgun. It's like I was saying, whatever would I do without my shotgun? It wasn't just a joke. Okay, so wait, I came from that way, but what's over here? Is this a secret? Or is this actually where I'm supposed to go? I think that might actually be where I'm supposed to go, which is kind of weird considering it opened up for that other path. Then it pointed it out to me. Well, let's try going that other way real quick. Let's see what we, uh, let's see what we can find. Why is my speed not kicking in? Is Dante is it because Dante's slow and old? Okay, yeah, this is the Nice. Alright. Don't have air hike. There are so many things I don't have with Dante that I wish I had. Okay. When I go back for secrets, which won't be after this session, but when I go back for them, I'll be I'll be grinding a bunch and getting a bunch of stuff for Dante. I wonder if he'll get more weapons though. Because Nero's getting more breakers. V's not getting a whole lot. Like after his introduction, he just kind of didn't get anything. Ah, oh, this never gets old. See, what I want to do is... I bet I have... 
How much do you want to bet I have to upgrade in order to get it? I'm trying to do the spin gun thing I was talking about a minute ago, and I can't do it. Why is it this working? Is there something missing? Must more orbs be spent? There's actually... Funny I mentioned that. There's this video I saw where... Uh, someone asked uh, Dan Southworth, the actor who plays Virgil, to, to say that at a convention. And he was just kind of like adding his own thing to it, like... You seem to be in a bad mood. Bro, why wouldn't I be in a bad mood? I'm trying to open the gates to hell and it's not working! I just thought that was really funny. Speaking of the voice actors, it's kind of weird how, like, you know, in the game, Dante's this goofy asshole who does all this dumb stuff, and it's hilarious, and then Virgil's the super serious one that wants more power and all that. But in real life, it's completely flipped around, like, their voice actors are the complete opposite, like, like, Ruben's usually the, the serious one that... He doesn't go on, about, on and on about power or anything like that, but... Dan, Dan Southworth was usually the one that's that's cracking jokes all the time. At least from what I've seen. God, and speaking of which, it, of all franchises, of all series in existence that could have some somewhat strong connections to Power Rangers, did not expect Devil May Cry to be one of them. Also didn't expect JoJo to be one of them, because apparently Tony Oliver, who worked on the uh worked on Power Rangers as a producer in the 90s, uh, he was working for Saban at that point. I think he helped compose some of the music too, I'm not sure. Uh, he is currently a voice director at Viz Media, and he was um, specifically he was part of the uh, he was the voice director for JoJo Part 3 and 4, uh, and eventually 5. So yeah, that's, uh, that's pretty cool. I'm sure there's more than that. Uh, he was actually going to go further than what's already been established, because like... Because, um, you know, I already pointed out that Nero and... Virgil were voiced by Power Rangers, but Ruben Langdon was also on Power Rangers. He wasn't like a regular character. He just had a couple cameo appearances in some episodes of Time Force. Um, and he, he was also, oh no. I've been killed. But then again, is there really death in this universe? Because, I mean, Virgil comes back like 18 times a week, so it's not that surprising. Just because he's that cool. But anyways, so, um, Virgil and Nero's voice actors were Power Rangers, and then uh, Dante's actor had some some cameos on the show as well. Because he, um, I think he was working, he was part of like the, the stunt team, I think. I think he was helped out with like choreography for fights and stuff like that for when they were filming original footage. But it was actually going to go a little bit further than that initially because Ruben was... Uh, Ruben Langdon was actually auditioning for the role of Dante, but then eventually he uh, he put it a good worth of mouth to the Capcom executives for people like Johnny Young Bosch, Dan Southworth. And he also tried to get Aaron Cahill, the person that plays uh, Jed Scott's in Time Force, to play the role of Lady, which that would have been really interesting. And then also, oh, Jason Font, oh, the guy who plays Wes, fast. also was, was also auditioned for the role of Dante. I think that would have been really interesting to see those two involved. And I mean, I, I would absolutely take Ruben over Jason. No offense, no offense to him, but like... Ruben just works so well as Dante. It's so perfect. His voice kind of evolved into, like, the quintessential Dante voice. It's kind of hard to describe why, but... I would definitely want to see Jason Font and Aaron Cahill evolved in this 
series to get it in some form or fashion. There we go, I did this. Oh wait, is that what I did wrong? I No, it's not hold it. Okay, seriously, how do I do the million stab with the stinger? How do I do it? Oh, okay. So it's like this. Okay, that sucks. That's not just weird. That just sucks. I would rather it be like in three, where you just have to, keep, where you just have to push the button again. Oh no, thank you. I'm not a fan of that. Da -da 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 boom. Try Royal Guard. Royal Guard's hard to use. Come on. Come on. Oh, it's like Kung Fu Dante. It's very strange. Alright, I'll be sticking with Swordmaster most of the time, I'll just say that right now. Actually, I already said it, but... I'll be sticking with the, uh... I'll be sticking with Swordmaster, because that's just... The, to me, that at least, that's the best. And the fact that you can do the mid-air attacks with Circle now... That's just the way it's meant to be. I'm just... I love DMC3 so much. I don't know, I think I already said that, but... DMC3 at this point is my favorite, but... This is definitely tied for that. Let's activate our DT for a bit. We got that upgrade that makes it last longer. And it heals even faster than before. My god, that is so useful. That is going to be a very valuable thing to have. Oh my god, I tore his ass to shreds. Get fucked, as the kids say. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh no, I'm losing my style. Ah, oh, damn. Ended with an A. That sucks. Oh god. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. <laughs> Man. I'm bored. He just stands there. All right. Let's get a move on. Don't want to spend too much time here. Ooh. Guess what? This isn't going to be a boss room. Oh, wait, no, maybe it is. Maybe this time it actually is. Wait a minute. It's that thing? No way. No way this is what I think it is. And he immediately doesn't target it. Okay, no, it's not what I thought it was. 
Oh wait, maybe it is. I don't know, I can't tell. I'm thinking it's the bat that turns to stone. I may or may not be right, I'm not sure. If he reproduces as I try to attack him, then it's the same thing. Okay, uh, looks like that's a negative. Oh! Oh! Damn it! He targeted the wrong guy. This is why I need to use lock on all the time. Let's try using this thing. We're not using this thing enough. Oh, that's interesting. So what do you do with like a forward attack? When you do a forward attack, it's punch mode. But when you hold back, it switches into kick mode. <gasps> oh, and wait, we've still got our rider kick. Yes! We've still got our rider kick. That's the quintessential um, armament move. I don't know what the official name for that sort of like, or what that sort of thing is categorized as. It's the thing that was like Beowulf, Infrared, whatever it was called in 4, which was not Balrog. I know for a fact it wasn't Balrog, because I would have remembered that. But it's that same kind of weapon. And the fact that we start with that basically made, that basically tells me it's like, yeah, you know what, we're... We're done screwing with you guys. You know, you want to play Dante. You want to play him with his quick set with like his his weapons of choice. So we'll just give you all the stuff you need instead of making you wait for it. Okay, I want this level to end just so I can take a break. <laughs> I want to keep playing as Dante, but I hope I can just do that in the next mission. Well, this is a. Oh. Uh, this is a really strange pathway. Oh, come on. If I had air hike, that would make my life so much easier. I can afford it. Come on, dude. Seriously? What's the point of that pathway? Oh, this looks like fun. I'm greedy. Wow, that was actually perfect. <laughs> I expected to fail and it would be really funny, but no. So this is like, what, the third time we've gone on this pathway? That's another way you can get enemies up in the air, which I really like. Alright. Hey, Dante, this look familiar? Remember when you killed your brother that one t No, I didn't actually. Technically, you didn't kill him, but... Oh, no. Oh, no, my DT ran out. That's a problem. Now I have to, like, think and feel. I have to like try and play good. 
I hate it. I hate everything about it. How does the shotgun not break through the shield? Okay, broke him at least. That's good. Let me try royal guarding these guys again. Nice. Ah, I screwed that up. What else? Whatever. The blood just disappeared right there. That was very strange. Well, we better not keep him waiting. Okay, another statue, because he doesn't know who Nico is at this point. In fact, I'm not even 100% sure that he knew who, that, or that Nero knew who he was at this point. All right, air hike because that'll be useful for dodging his attacks. And, uh... Eh, why the hell not? We'll get Stinger too. Alright, let's, uh, let's go not kill this guy because we know how the last attempt went. Oh, yeah. I'm feeling it. <sighs> oh, yeah. I'm feeling it. No, come on. <laughs> Lady, you were the best. How did how did you just lose like that? Well, well. Oh, king of stench and filth. <laughs> I'm impressed. Those are two of the most badass women in the world. Damn right. And I only know one other guy who can defeat them. Jackpot. Oh, he said the thing. He said the thing. Oh, Why is the subtitle still on screen? That was weird. All right. Well, we have significantly less health, and I know every time we fought this guy, we have to lose to him, so... Uh, I'm just gonna do what I did last time. I'm just gonna try and break his stuff and fail at doing so. Cause we all know that we're not that this guy's not supposed to be killed at this point. I'm sure we'll get him eventually when he turns back into Virgil. Cause at this point they basically just confirmed, yeah, no, it's him. They like in that in that beginning cutscene they basically confirmed, yeah, it's totally Virgil, dude. <laughs> so I was right, yay! All cause I knew who voiced him. That was the, that was pretty much the only thing I had to base it on. Wow, did he kill me that quickly? I didn't even see my health go down. I knew I didn't have much of it, but still. It was a little too fast. Oh, he was running on the thing! Oh my god! And Nero just walks in like, what have I stumbled into? <laughs> Warning, dead weight approaching. <laughs> All right, and uh, that's that's when we uh, we came in and ruined everything as Nero. All right, so that is recording session number two done. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you when we get back here with the the default colors next time. Bye.